imagine that you went from a teenager to a young adult. And yet, you have a sexual fetish for a cartoon character. Now, unlike like an actual TV show where they're like a actual live action where they use actual actors and actresses. Uh, so, after you're having a thing for like a, having a crush on an uh, actor or an actress, uh, okay, that is normal, but... But a, char a cartoon character, okay, that is just nuts. So whether you're male or female, and I know uh, you can listen also, uh, some people also have an LGBT, like a gay or lesbian relationship, like crush or that, but it's just yeah, nuts, it is just nuts. So, how would you, uh, like, uh, how would people look at it when, uh, like, they, like, your friends and family hear that you have a sexual fetish for a cartoon character instead of an actual legit human being. Now this is what Ron like what uh, Harrison Wine and Thunderbird have been saying for uh ever ever since um Idle Upon the uh, Equestria Girls that came out and yeah. And if you haven't noticed their post, uh, they do that. Now, seriously. If you literally have a sexual fetish for like a male or female character, so uh, yeah. Of the opposite gender, or if you're LGBT, uh, yeah. That is still considered weird because, uh, yeah. You could have just said that that's my favorite character uh, out of the entire uh, you know, whatever TV series or movie series it is. Uh. But if you have a sexual fetish, okay. You don't really need to get your brain checked. I mean, just look how Harrison White and Dander Bird would say, My wife. I mean, damn. Doofus, you're not even married. And, uh, yeah. Rarity is not real. Rarity is a cartoon character. And how could you say uh, shut up with girlfriend when technically uh, if, are you trying to be Nick Cannon and trying to be a womanizer? Or fuck with that girls every day of the week. Because if you're trying to be a player, damn. You're nuts, man. You're nuts. And in reality, if you like, uh, like, if um, if you're in love with one person, but the user found out that they're, they're, they're also in love with another friend, and you also have an intimate relation with the other, yeah, of course, that uh, she won't get jealous, and yeah, and then they gonna turn on you. Okay, sexiest swimsuit. Okay, that's literally uh, like literally calling when when people call the actress uh, Millie Bobby Brown sexiest woman alive. And then Millie Bobby Brown, she's a legit teenager. Yeah, she's yeah the one from who like uh, did uh, the role of uh, Eleven from uh, you know Stranger Things that Netflix series. Yeah. Yeah, she trashed out Tom Holland. Yeah, yeah, but that bitch couldn't even uh, eat, eat uh, the entire wing.
there's nothing wrong about saying in a favorite song but, or a favorite uh, special, uh, but the fact that the, the fetish one, yeah. Literally having a sexual fetish for a, a, something that ain't real. Literally, Harrison White and Xander Bernard literally turning out like that Japanese guy who like literally made a, like a, uh, what what was it? Uh, uh, one of those, uh, a cartoon character. Yeah, it was, it was in the showed up in the Asian news, uh, but yeah. And the uh, dude actually encourages it, yeah. All with Japan and their crazy stuff. Alongside that guy who wants to they literally uh, got well, got himself a dog suit and literally acts like a dog. And uh, apparently not just uh, Harrison White and Xander Bird, but uh, apparently there's some other people uh, who also have a sexual fetish for uh, cartoon characters, while uh, upon the Equestria Girls characters mainly. And, yeah. Also, those people need to get their brain checked as well, because, yeah. How would the people in your own life find out? What would they say? And if they actually support this, yeah, those people also need to get their brain checked as well. Because it's one thing to have a crush on like uh, an actor or actress uh, doing a TV uh, series or movie role, or uh, like a cartoon, you know, or the voice actor or actress uh, doing the, that role, but uh, voice acting. But uh, but it is a psychotic, nuts thing to actually have a sexual fetish for something that ain't real. And that's why uh, our new generation is really failing. And I don't know how many times I've seen... uh, Harrison White and Xander Bird, uh, say with my wife and such, but yeah. I think Caden Mace also did this too, but I don't recall. Maybe like a month ago. But these uh, people and uh, their supporters really need to get their brain checked. Like, what the hell?